Our next speaker has been practicing yoga since 1988 and discovered acro yoga in 2011. He says he plays well with others. Please welcome Jim Gilligan. All right. Thanks, Ryan. Thank you. Hit it. You want to play? Remember when those words uh, opened up a world of possibility where just a couple playmates and our bodies and our imaginations led us to fantastic worlds of joy. I want to fly you. Remember flying on someone's feet way up in the air, no gravity, no weight on your mom or your dad, brother or sister, just feeling that connection. Well, we can do that now. We're a little bit bigger, but using the... Um, the mechanical, uh, good mechanics of acro yoga and staying within our roles of base, spotter, and especially the spotter and the flyer. Well, I know what you're thinking, what if I fall? Well, I like this quote from Aaron Hansen. There is freedom waiting for you on the breezes of the sky. And you ask, what if I fall? Oh, but my darling, what if you fly? And flying is what we do in acro yoga. Uh, acro yoga blends the uh, wisdom of yoga, the dynamic power of acrobatics, and the loving kindness of Thai massage. With the roles of base, flyer, and spotter, we can begin connecting, flying, supporting, and playing. And sometimes it might seem like a struggle at first, but through a little bit of work and maybe a playmate comes along and gives you a little tip, suddenly the, the effort goes away. And the challenge is, here uh, Stephanie was so afraid to fly, but I encouraged her as she was working on her own scorpion practice and her yoga practice to elevate that scorpion practice. And she worked on it. And we kidded her because she had a little bun, so it made it a little easier. But... We celebrated her success at the end. And then you're really flying, using good mechanics, stacking bones so it becomes alignment versus strength. This is kind of cool. The uh, age difference there is about 50 years between those two couples. So um, it's successful to everyone, and it's fueled by laughter. Here we see good balance, good, um, good stacking, lots of smiles and joy as we just relish in each other. And then as we get uh, more comfortable and gain trust, we start to connect. First through touch, then through the eyes, the heart, and finally the soul. And then there's the touch. In this touch of verse society, we maybe realize how much we miss touch. And it's also an opportunity for us to become more aware of our bodies. I might ask my flyer to soften his feet. That's really something to think about. And will you fly me? Because I really love to fly. It's pretty scary at first, but I love developing that trust with a partner, having that connection, feeling that joy and that weightlessness. I think everyone should feel that joy and that weightlessness, regardless of size. <laughs> Imagine if this is how we met each other. Imagine if this is how we got to know each other, <laughs> instead of a handshake. A lot going on in this picture. My friend Amy, a fellow acro yoga teacher, is flying Chief Jackson in his Maasai village. Let culture, class, race, and gender dissolve, and you have two playmates. Imagine if our world leaders met this way. <laughs> huh? And after that solar acrobatic part, how about a little flying Thai massage? This is the lunar part of acro yoga. Uh, nice suspended, how about a, um, how about a nice assisted back bend or a uh, assisted spinal twist? Can everyone say, ah, let's hear you say, ah. Yeah, it's like that, exactly. <laughs> so through this, we begin opening our hearts, changing our perspective, and hopefully as we uh, build this, this uh, practice of trust and joy and communication, we maybe change our perspective enough 
This is cool. We were playing around at the spring game. You can just see me and Sophia by the uh, eagle there, and this kid stopped in his tracks to watch. Could you imagine a world in which adults playing were so commonplace that it would not stop a kid in his tracks? Do you want to play? We want to fly you. We'd love to have you at Acro Yoga Ann Arbor to play with us. Thank you so much. Thank you.